you've seen some fantastic models and builds on Roblox, and you've even tried to create some of your own. But how can you go from something like this to something like this? Well, the foundation of any good build is its models. And I've got five building tips for you for how you can create professional models starting right now. So my first tip is to go and look up some reference pictures like these. This will give you ideas and it'll help you know what uh, smaller details you want to add later that will really make your model shine. The second tip is to use a basic character model for size reference and this will help your model or build feel proportionally accurate. A quick tip for smaller models is that you can build them small from the start and then they're already the right size or you can start by building a larger model to get all your details right and then you can scale it down by either scaling the whole model in Studio or using a plugin such as Studio Build Suite or F3X. To continue that thought a little bit, tip number three is to use special meshes for really thin or minute parts and you can achieve this by changing the scale of special meshes. This is really useful for smaller details that others might miss adding to their models and that will set your models above the competition. Tip four is to use unions and meshes for more complex shapes. You can do a lot with the basic shapes, but a proper use of meshes or unions can really take your models to the next level. And there are plenty of great mesh packs in the toolbox if you don't want to make your own or can't make your own. And you can always combine the two as well. I do, and it works great. All right, so tip five is to use decals and textures to add unique details to your models. And this is especially useful when you're adding cool details like wall photos or maybe something more subtle like the tree rings on this log. The most important tip of all is to practice. And once you start regularly using these tips and these techniques, your build quality will improve greatly. Don't forget to subscribe and let me know in the comments which tip helped you the most. And for other building tips, you can go check out this video. Thanks for watching and I'll see you again in the next video.